Hi, hi, welcome to Toby Edward Photos. And yes, I have another Porsche behind me. I'm a massive Porsche fan. Um, and this is no regular Porsche. It's a GT3, as you can see. Um, some of you may be forgiven for mistaken it for a GT3 RS with that huge wing, but this wing is even larger than a GT3 RS. Uh, it is called full carbon fiber, um, and it looks like a bit of a Porsche construction site right now with all this blue tape. That's because Mark, who's standing just over there, um, he's an engineer and he makes fast cars go faster and great handling cars turn greater, better. Um, and that's what all this is. He's just marking out everything, kind of like a blueprint of how exactly he's going to be making this into an insane Porsche GT3. Um, the previous owner already supercharged it, so it's already north of 750 horsepower. So why get a GT2 RS really, just do that and supercharge it. Or twin turbo it, I've seen that before, but um, Supercharging a Porsche. I'm not really sure how I feel on it, being a big Porsche enthusiast. So I had to move the camera. Um, some guys came by, so sorry for the change of angle here, but you get to look at that gorgeous rear end. Um, anyway, as I was saying, they're now about to go back. So uno momento. Just stand here. I don't hate your f guts. Anyway, uh, what was it? Oh, twice now. So, as I mentioned, it's, uh, it's a bit of a sacrilegious Porsche for me. Um, being a big Porsche enthusiast, um, and I'm, I'm more of a purist, I like an OEM car, um, you know, exhaust and stuff, I can get on board with that. But this is completely changing the car and it's going to be changed even further. Um, so, I'm not allowed to tell you what they're doing, but basically, they're going to be uh, making big Be huge so imagine that it's it's gonna be nuts all right as promised I'm here with Mark the engineer behind all this crazy stuff Hello. Um, and this is the Porsche that we just had outside recently um, doing some photos so uh, yeah, do you want to tell them a little bit about sure, it? Sure, sure. You didn't tell me anything about no, this, did no, you? No, 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 I didn't. Um, no. You didn't? No. All right, all right. Yeah, all right. So, anyway. uh, so the whole premise behind this car uh, was to take multiple, really two or three scientific principles that aren't normally used in the automotive world, combine them and put them onto a car. Mm -hmm. um, it's definitely something people have never seen before. It's it's pretty intense. I think uh, people are gonna be pretty shocked when they see it. Yeah, I remember when you showed me first, I was I looked at it and I had to yeah. I had to take a few minutes to wrap my head around it. Yeah. Yeah. But um, it's it's very exciting and you plan on, on SEMA. That's correct. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna debut this uh, SEMA twenty twenty one. we will probably have it at Festival of Speed. We won't be showing all its characteristics. We're really just gonna be showing um, more of the, the cosmetic the look of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm sure most of you know, being car enthusiasts, but um, SEMA is an annual car show. You call it a car show, right? Sure, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, it's not just the sort of thing you pull up in a car and sit around and then talk. <laughs> it's, it's a very expensive yeah, thing. Yeah. So Jimmy's not pulling up in his like, you know, 99 Civic exactly. with, with a yeah. Yeah, AEM intake or yeah. something. You're going yeah. there to, to show something and, yeah. and technologies and what you've done. And, and this man here does loads of carbon fiber stuff. Um, so there's also going to be a new type of carbon fiber that hasn't been seen yet on this car. That's correct. Um, and that, that we can talk debuting. about. We, we can, can talk, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so tell them as much as you, as you do. Uh, so the, the carbon that, that we are going to be placing on this car, uh, we call it Blue Forge Chameleon. Um, so you've seen Forge, everyone's seen Forge on Lamborghini. Um, 
this is, we came up with a manufacturing technique to almost make that kind of look, but do it where it has the full strength of actual prepreg right. carbon with pretty much any color you can imagine. Yeah. So, and the color we decided to go with is uh, chameleon blue. And I remember you telling me, so I've, I didn't know this until I met Mark, but apparently Lamborghini made or invented forged carbon fiber, mm -hmm. not because it's better than regular carbon fiber, but because it's cheaper. It's cheaper, yeah. Cheaper. yeah. Lamborghini, yeah. going cheaper. Yeah, yeah. They, uh, they teamed up with, um, uh, I can't remember their name, the guy's name, but uh, basically they, they wanted to find a way to make really nice carbon fiber that looks you know, really nice, um, just it's a lot cheaper than real pre prepreg carbon. Uh, so they ended up coming up with forged which looks beautiful, but you are giving up uh, some of the strength characteristics, some of the weight characteristics. It's basically just like um, how you would infuse plastic, like you'd mold yeah. plastic. It's, it's shot through a nozzle into a mold, high speed, right. uh, and then it makes this, which is a, a cheaper and easier way of making it than say what we do with like yeah. autoclave or out of autoclave prepregs. Um, what we figured out how to do um, is how to manufacture that with all the strength characteristics of the prepreg, but still get the looks of the forge. And then we took it a step further and came up with uh, a couple different things, one of them being blue forge chameleon. All right, so um, like I said, uh, we will be featuring Mark Moore and definitely this car. Um, I'm gonna, I'm not going to be able to show the build process as much because obviously it's, it's sort of top secret right now, mm. but um, any updates I'm allowed to give you, I will definitely give you because- After, you know, after we debut it, yeah. you know, sure, yeah. Like go back and right. do like a, this is the creation of, yeah. so. So next thing, if anything, um, if there is a next point involved with this car, it will be at the track mm -hmm. because I, I, I aim to be out there. Um, so yeah. Oh, you're more than welcome. Come on out today. Yeah, for sure. <laughs>